has turned on the seatbelt light. Please take your seat and fasten your seatbelts. Thank you. Timing can be applied to frames as well as to individual objects in a frame. This can be done in the properties window panes for frames and objects, and it can also be done in the timeline window pane, which is especially useful for objects because it gives you a visual representation of what's going on. Transitions are used to determine how frames come into view and leave from view. If you double-click on a frame, you can select the Frame Transition section in the Frame Properties window pane. In the Time Span section, use the top field to enter the number of seconds you want the frame to be displayed before moving on to the next frame. You can select the option to pause the timing of the frame if you want the user to take some kind of action to continue the movie. In the Transition section, first select one of the transition effects for the frame, then set the transition's duration and direction. Press the Play button in the Frame Editor preview bar to see how the transition will look in the output. If you double-click an object, you can expand the General section. You can then enter a start time for the object and a total length of time. For example, if you select 2 in the first field, the object will first appear after the frame has been open for 2 seconds. And if you enter 8 in the next field, it means the object will display for a total of 8 seconds before disappearing. The Timeline window pane can be opened from the View menu. It displays at the bottom of the workspace. You can change the timing of the entire frame by dragging the far right edge to the left or the right. You can change the timing of objects by clicking and dragging their left and right edges. As you can see in this example, we have multiple objects that are set to start and finish at different times. In the Timeline window pane, there are options to lock objects so they can't be edited, and to show or hide them in the frame. For more information about timing and transitions, see the online help.